At Audiology Associates of Prestonsburg, you can live your life the way you want and find the freedom of better hearing. You'll experience patient care that is specific to you with exceptional follow-up care that ensures your hearing and balance needs are being met. Audiology Associates at 1428 North Lake Drive in Prestonsburg. On Monday, August 15th, the Pikeville Police and Fire Departments, along with the Community Outreach Program, hosted a golf scramble for charity. The money raised will be going towards Christmas gifts for needy children, especially those affected by the recent flooding. This is the first time we've, I think we've had the golf scramble itself. Uh, this is to raise money for outreach program, uh, for school supplies for children, uh, Christmas gifts for children, and we're, it's a joint effort between us and the uh, Pikeville Fire Department to uh, get this going on up here. We, we have 17 teams show up, which is on a Monday, and it overcast and rainy like it is, is, is great. So these, all these uh, guys come in here and donate the money and put up money for it. And uh, so it's, it's a good deal. It's a, it's a thing. It's going to be a, a yearly event now. Uh, I think this is the first actual first golf scramble we've had, though. So the turnout's great. Uh, we had 20 teams sign up, sign up for it, and we had 17 teams show up. Like I said, on a Monday morning, and it overcast and rainy everywhere but here. And we were blessed with the, with the good weather. It's not rained on us yet. And uh, the turnout's been great. Everybody's morale's great. Uh, everybody's pumped up. They want to win it. You know, there's still competition here. And uh, so they want to win it. And uh, we'll, we'll hope the, the best team uh, prevails and uh, gets their prize. So, Our detective, Bruce Collins, uh, he's an avid golfer. Uh, also a patrolman, Josh Lawson, he is an avid golfer. He's on one of the teams today uh, for the city. Uh, he, they come up with the ideal, uh, passed it along to the chief. The chief thought it was a great idea to raise, uh, raise money. And it gets everybody outside, it gets everybody outdoors, uh, enjoying their self, physical fitness too, and, and uh, camaraderie, everybody having a good time today. And, and so those guys come up with the idea and the chief was more than willing and the city backed us up and said, hey, yeah, let's do this. So, uh, and Stonecrest provided us with this uh, absolute beautiful location to do this in. It's, it's, it's amazing up here. While both the police and firefighters are glad the funds are going towards a good cause, the participants at Stonecrest are also happy to get out, share a round of golf with each other, and help their community. Well, um, first of all, uh, it's, it's a great day to be out here. Uh, you know, the Pikeville uh, Police Department uh, hosting this event today to raise money for uh, children for Christmas and, uh, and I know we're recognizing the wound, wounded warriors. So. It's great to be out here, and the day is it's perfect weather, uh, you know, cool, not too hot, and, uh, you know, a good turnout for a great event, a great cause. I'm, I'm glad to see that people have come together again, and, and there's, a lot of, there's a lot of damage, and it's, it's just terrible what's happened to, around eastern Kentucky with the flooding. But, you know, uh, people will, they'll, they'll bounce back, and they're, they're very resilient, and they'll bounce back. For Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.